it's a, a pleasure and an honor to be here with so many friends and partners who are committed to financial literacy and, and empowerment. Oftentimes when I talk with folks about the need for financial literacy, not only across our state, but here in Howard County, people don't recognize the importance. They think that everybody here in the county is wealthy, uh, we've got money lined in our beds and we walk on streets of gold. But that's not the case for everyone, unfortunately. And it also is not necessarily going to be the case for our future generations. So it's a pleasure for everyone to come out and focus on financial literacy and focus on financial empowerment. Uh, but we can't do this alone. Five years ago, or maybe six years ago, when I was the community organizer before I was in the county council, I saw a lot of people struggling, a lot of people having problems, and this was before we saw one of the uh, worst financial collapses in, in, in our history. And so four years ago, it was a great vision being able to partner with people across the county and the state on making sure that we recognize and we work toward the importance of financial education. And one of those great partners was uh, our county executive, Ken Ullman who I talked to and I reached out to and he demonstrated an immediate commitment and a recognition also of the importance of financial education and empowerment. Each year, not only does he partner with uh, those across the county to make sure that financial literacy is a, is a priority, but also makes April Financial Literacy Month to help make sure that it's a visible priority for, for the county. So I'd like to take a moment right now to recognize and introduce my friend, our county executive, Ken Ullman. 